modifying the display units. In Pipeflow Expert, certain measures are displayed on your drawing. These include pipe diameter, length, node elevation, and flow rate, for example. Currently, you can see that some of the units are measured in meters and meters cubed per second, just to name a few. To define the units used in Pipeflow Expert and the pipe system, click Choose Units button on the toolbar to open the Units tab of the Configuration Options screen. The units are displayed in three sections, namely pipes, tanks, nodes, control and components, and system results, which all refer to their associate displayed units. You can toggle all the units by clicking the Imperial or Metric options in the Change All Units section of the Units tab. You can also individually select the units for each component in the drop-down menus. Click OK to save the unit configuration and close the Configuration Options dialog. We can now see that the units have changed to our preferred chosen display units. You might also find it useful to save your preferred units options for the next design. To do this, open a blank system and then configure the individual units as you wish. You can save this system as, say, default units.pfe. If you choose default units.pfe file a lot, then it will also show up in your recent files list on the file menu. Just simply load this file each time you start a new system. Download your free trial of Pipeflow Expert today at www.pipeflow.com.